Hi, this is Jim Helgendorf. My wife Elizabeth and I are continuing our journey of traveling together to a new America. Elizabeth passed away a little over a year ago, but we're together still, heart to heart, moving together in life and death, reaching out to people all across this country in towns and cities with our journey, with our book. You know, uh, at this time, there's a, a new world really crying for expression uh, to come into being amid all of the chaos, the violence, the division, the wars, uh, the pandemic is separating us, fracturing us. This is a time we need to promote bonds, spiritual bonds among people, not only of America, but the world, almost a new uh, spiritual globalization. Uh, I'd like to read just a short piece to you today. Uh, this is called, We Are One. War and holocaust will never end until men and women come to see themselves as they truly are. We are not separate, we are one. Electrons on one side of the galaxy vibrate to electrons just down the block. The universe is one big brother, tearing the hearts from one another fractures our circulation. Arteries become clogged. There's no joy. Boundless expansion awaits the human race if we can become the human race. Just one race, not two or three or 30,000. We all want to be ourselves, but there is no self to ourselves unless it reach to the boundaries of stars and suns and moons. Look into your neighbor's eye. There you are, reflected in his vision and he or she in turn reflected in your own. But we cannot truly see. Our intent is to destroy the mirror in front of us, the other eye envisioning us by war, by mayhem, by blossoming mushroom clouds. But the reflection rebounds endlessly back upon us through corridors of celestial mirrors, fracturing the heart of all time and space. We are not alone and never have been alone. Let the heart grow stronger, binding us to everyone, to ourselves. And finally, I'd just like to say, um, amid this kind of darkening time, please keep faith with yourself, with your greatest dreams, not only for yourself, but for other people, and for America, and for the world. Nam yo ho renge kyo.